Okay, first question off the bat. You know, there's so much talk about NASCAR these days, the Indy races. What makes the truck racing special for you? Uh, for me, it's just, uh, you know, the, the toughness, uh, you know, the competition in the truck series. Uh, you got a lot of guys who, uh, you know, you have veteran drivers who have been to Cup and, and they're back now. Uh, so it makes the, the series uh, really competitive and tough. And uh, I just like the style of, of racing that we got with the trucks. Uh, we got real short races. Guys are usually beating and banging on each other, uh, out of control, sideways. You see uh, some stuff you wouldn't normally see in a Sprint Cup race. And, and uh, it makes it really exciting for me. I enjoy running. Uh, for being an up-and-coming driver, so to speak, uh, how special is it to be part of uh, a family like Roush Fenway Racing? Well, uh, being with Roush Fenway Racing has been huge for me. You know, I feel very fortunate, and uh, I'm appreciative of the fact that uh, Jack gave me a chance to do this. Uh, you know, you couldn't ask for a better team to be with, in my opinion. Uh, we've got the resources to go out and run well. Uh, you know, Jack's got, uh, we've got truck series team, nationwide series teams, and uh, sprint cup series teams. So uh, we've got a big organization, uh, so we've got a lot of resources to, to pull from. And uh, it helps me out having uh, veteran drivers like Matt Kenseth, Greg Biffle, uh, you know, Carl Edwards. I can go to those guys if I have anything to, to ask them about, and they'll definitely help me out, and, and they have so far up to this point. Uh, you've broken into the top ten in the point standings. Uh, you know, people look at that. How difficult is it to get into that top ten? Well, it's tough to be in the top ten, but we, we were there earlier this year, had a couple bad races and, and fell out. Um, you know, I honestly believe with the team that we've got assembled right now, we are going to be competing for a top five in points, if not the championship. Um, you know, we've, we've had strong trucks and, and strong runs and lead laps this year and just don't have all the finishes to show for it. So to be able to put everything together at Michigan last week was good, and, and uh, we're looking to do the same at Milwaukee. You know, you race, your father raced, your grandfather raced. Um, what kind of advice did you get watching them, learning from them over the years? Uh, the, probably the best advice I got from them, those guys was just to have fun with it. You know, they never pressured me to do this if I didn't want to do it. Um, you know, but they supported me the whole time, and I wouldn't have been able to do it without those two. Um, you know, without the, all their hard work and, and my grandpa, uh, you know, financially supporting the race team and everything, I wouldn't have been able to do it without them. But you know, best advice they probably gave me was just to have fun with it and, and uh, you know, try to do the best you could do, and, and uh, it's taken me this far. You, your dad, your grandpa, who's the better driver? <laughs> I, I don't know. We uh, actually did a little deal earlier, uh, radio deal, and, and uh, I got asked if I raced against either one of them before, and my first race in a, in a full-size car, or, or, you know, scale car anyway, uh, closer to a full-size car, my grandfather bought one too and raced against me, and uh, I wrecked him the first night out. So uh, I don't know who's a better driver. He'll probably tell you he is. I'll probably tell you I am. But uh, I think all three of us are pretty good. What about the rest of the family? Who are they going to pick? I don't know. So you mentioned, you know, obviously being uh, so close in Illinois, do you still have a lot of family and friends there? Do you expect a lot of people to come out and support you this weekend? Yeah. Uh, you know, my, my parents and grandparents still all live in northeastern Illinois, uh, where I grew up. Uh, so I enjoy coming back to the mile every week or every year. Um, uh, just because I got a lot of family and friends out here. We'll have a bunch of people out at the track, um, and I'm actually going to stay at home for a couple of days and, and visit with some people before we come back out here for the race. So uh, I really enjoy coming here every year. It's a lot of fun for me. Uh, being so close growing up, who was your favorite racer? Uh, being close, I, I'm not really sure. Um, you know, I never really got a chance to watch Dick Trickle or any of those guys race. I was a little bit older by, by that time, but uh, I, I mean, I really enjoyed watching my dad race. He's the one I kind of grew up around watching. Uh, but as far as Cup Series stuff goes, I was always a Dale Earnhardt fan. Loved his driving style. I uh, liked the way he drove, and um, you know, he was one of my favorites. I followed him a lot coming up.